Gentlemen, thank you so much for doing this interview with me. Uh, Cardinal, did you think that it would be the phenomena that it has and is setting a, a pace when it comes to Canadian television? Something new, something different, something exciting, but something very cool at the same time. I, you know, I, I didn't, I didn't, uh, I had, I think, next to no expectations in the beginning. What That's I, nice to hear. I did, no, I didn't, I didn't because what, but what I, I, I didn't have expectations. I try not to have expectations, yeah, yeah. but I had hopes, and my hopes were high because of the material. The material was fantastic, and then I met this guy uh, in uh, Copenhagen, and it kind of, my expectations kind of dropped a bit again. But imagine but, my end. Yeah, but then, like a, yeah. but then they, but then they, they bounced back up after we started working together, uh, and I realized that he wasn't quite the person I thought he was. Uh, so. Yes, low expectations in the beginning, high hopes, and uh, hugely gratified now. What is it like to be, you know, direct for something like this that's fast? There are times when it's just like you've got the slow pace and then bam, it's just like it just keeps coming at you, coming at you. That's to me what makes this show so great. Uh, well, yeah, but it's, a lot of that is in the writing. Uh, so the, the pace is there and, the, and it's constructed that way. And it's just to kind of, you know, you. you you don't know if it's fast if you don't have the slow moments to compare it to. If it's only fast, then it's boring. And if it's only slow, it's boring. So to have that rhythm, it's kind of like sex, you know? <laughs> to have that rhythm going. Oh, wow. Wait a minute. Oh, you remember that? I've been doing it wrong the yeah, whole you time. Were. Yeah, you uh, were. I sent you videos. Yeah, you did. Yeah. What can we expect with the new season, though? Because, like I said, that pace has really been getting stronger and stronger each time. Well, yeah, a lot of stuff is happening in the third season. So, Carnal's dealing with Catherine's death. There's a new baddie in town, and he has uh, a different case to go to. So, there's a lot of different strands, a lot of different layers going on at the same time. So, it's going to be pretty. It's pretty eventful season. Sue, how do you think your your characters evolved, especially with the death and everything else? How do you think it's been evolving? Well. <laughs> You know, it, it's like he's, um, I don't know, he's, he, he's a pretty, <clears throat> pretty hard on himself from the beginning. So it's a, I think of it a little bit, <laughs> he's a little bit like a cement mixer, do you know what I mean? It, it, it's like, it just, he's just kind of flopping over on himself. He already felt bad, and now he feels bad about something else. Well, let's flip over and feel bad about the first thing. I don't know. He's a... Uh, he evolves, yes, but I think he evolves in terms of his relationship with other people, specifically with uh, Delorme. with Delorme. Yeah. yeah, yeah, definitely. Look, guys, congratulations on getting a new season going on. Cannot wait to see this. I keep asking you this every year, though. Movie, movie, movie. Yeah, I'm shooting one now. You are? Yeah, not Carnal, but another movie in Montreal. Yeah. What, what's the movie? Uh, about the mafia, Montreal mafia, Mafia Incorporated. Okay, can we get this guy in this in this mafia movie? Well, he's not Italian, so. And I don't speak French. French. So, you know. You could pull it up. Well, it's in French, English, and Italian, so yeah. Yeah, it's a, it's, yeah we're shooting it the, um, in the fall, so. Fantastic. Should Guys, see it next year, yeah. Congratulations on the new season. Thank you. Thanks.